It's all in your head. Remember, the reason why you are displacing and not replacing and adding instead of cutting out large chunks of your meal plan is because you're trying to work with your psychology. When you start taking out dishes from your meal plan, your mind starts feeling left behind. Deep down inside, you start to feel that you're denying yourself. You feel like you're losing something. I'm sure I don't need to remind you that one of the most powerful human impulses is the fear of loss or getting left behind. This is the reason why people who live in certain neighborhoods automatically get the urge to buy the same car as their neighbor once their neighbor rolls around in a new set of wheels. I've seen this happen quite a bit. It only takes one neighbor to buy a new top-of-the-line Mercedes-Benz or BMW to get other neighbors to want to buy the same kind of car. The same applies to clothes. The same applies to food and lifestyle. We don't like to get left behind. We don't like to feel like we are denying ourselves. This is exactly the kind of mindset you trigger when you choose to replace certain food items from your diet on a wholesale basis. Don't do it. Instead, keep adding ketogenic meal items to your diet. Eventually, you will reach a point where your taste buds have switched over to a fat preference. You're no longer craving sweets. You no longer feel like you can't go a day without carbohydrates. That's when these carb items start dropping from your meal plan. 